Father, in the name of Jesus, I just want to lift up this time to you and everything that I'm going to share in this video. Lord, if it is from you, let it go forth and bear fruit. What is not from you, let it fall down to the ground and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Amen. So, my dear brothers and sisters, I just want to share another dream with you. Uh, I need to give you a little bit of background because before I share this. So, yesterday I had some time. Uh, normally, I don't have weekends off, but this weekend I'm off. So, I was seeking the Lord, spending time with Him, and that's my most favorite thing to do. Just having a day, just me and the Lord is like my retreat and a wonderful time. I don't get many of these. I used to get a lot of these a couple of years ago, but now things have got busy. So anyway, I was enjoying my time with the Lord. And uh, the Lord kind of led me on a rabbit trail. And then I found this um, man of God. Now... With my upbringing and the way I see things, anyone who speaks of the Lord and anybody who gives prophecies, I don't take it just like I don't accept it right in the beginning. If this is somebody new and if I don't know their track records, even if it bears a witness in my heart, I always take it to the Lord. And I say, Lord, can I trust this person? Is this prophecy from you? Are you speaking through this man or this brother? And uh, so that's how I, that's how I have always done. And the Lord has guided me, guarded me, and protected me from uh, things that uh, would otherwise may be detrimental for my growth and my journey uh, with the Lord. So, I heard this prophecy about wiki cats. Now, this, compared to Sheba, you could buy in the billions right now for a very small amount of money. And it's not been many days, days since this prophecy came out. I will put the link below for this uh, man of God in the description and also on the video that it pops up. Hopefully I can do it right. Anyway, so I heard this video and I heard the prophecy. And because as you all know that uh, my journey, crypto journey, only started around three months ago, end of September 2022. So I was quite late. So by this time, Luna Classic, Tarot Luna Classic has obviously gone up in price. Shiba has gone up in price. So people who bought these assets, cryptos, maybe a year ago or a year and a half ago, could buy a lot more for $100. And now for the same $100, uh, we get very less. So I feel that God is giving this information for those who have been late, for those who have not been able to acquire as many as they need. So um, I straight away went to the Lord and I just, put my request out and I said Lord is this from you only if you give me a word I will go ahead otherwise I will not even touch it it doesn't matter who says it could be um, a well-known prophet it could be somebody who has a track record it, it really doesn't matter for me I need to hear from God and only if it is in God's will I will do it even as much as spending ten dollars because he wants us to be good stewards of his money. And uh, this this is like, you know, literally cutting it on the shoestring budget of a shoestring budget. So I have to be careful how much I spend. Um, anyway, so I asked the Lord and, you know, uh, with my experience in the past many years, I just know when God gives you a word, it's like he confirms it again and again. And this is the word he gave me and it blew my mind. 
Okay, let me read this to you. This is in Zechariah 4, and you can see my Bible marked, and um, I'm going to read from 6. This is what the Lord says to Zerubbabel. It is not by force, not by strength, but by my spirit, says the Lord of heaven's armies. Nothing, not even a mighty mountain, will stand in Zerubbabel's way. It will become a level plain field before him. And when Zerubbabel sets the final stone of the temple in place, the people will shout, May God bless it, may God bless it. And this one is like a personal promise to me for my life that God had given me many, many years ago. Zerubbabel is the one who laid the foundation of this temple and he will complete it. Then you will know the Lord of heaven's armies has sent me. Do not despise these small beginnings for the Lord rejoices to see the work begin, to see the plumb line in Zerubbabel's hand. Now, this blew my mind because something like this, you can see other dates marked on my, in my Bible. And these are very significant when God gives you the same word again and again. So I just felt that I need to share this with you, my dear brothers and sisters. And then this was yesterday. So then I prayed and I went back to sleep. And sometime during the night, I had a dream. And this dream was quite faint. So I really had to uh, kind of dig within myself to remember what it was. And it was so faint. Um, so anyway, let me tell you the dream. So in the dream, I saw like there are three heaps. You know, if you could put like something light like popcorn into a mountain. Okay, so they were very light. So I'm taking these, these, um, so the three mountains, the three hills, if I could say, like a heap of um, this popcorn like coins, very light. One was um, Sheena Inu, Walt Inu, and Wiki Cat, three of them. And uh, I'm picking up each one of them so it's almost like it's somewhere out there in the yard and i'm bringing it in a bag and putting it into three different um stacks in my yard so this is my house and i'm pouring it because they're so light i can quickly go grab some more put it back quickly go go grab grab some more and put it back so it's not really making me um, strain too much like I'm not losing energy within a short space of time I'm able to kind of collect this where it was available and then I'm bringing it and putting it in my yard so it's secure in my yard like in my house in the front of the house and I heard someone shout to say the longer you leave it these are going to get heavier and heavier so imagine, instead of bringing a whole big sack of popcorn, instead of that, you have to bring a whole big sack of corn. Now, you won't be able to carry that big sack of corn. Maybe some strong men might be able to carry it, but I don't think maybe I, I, I will be able to carry so much because I think they the corn, when they sow these seeds, come in like bags of 50 kilos I don't think I can carry 50 kilos maybe I could carry up to about maybe 15 kilos or 20 kilos but these popcorns the the sack that I was bringing it was like maybe one kilo for a big sack so anyway and that was the dream and the dream ended when I woke up I remembered what God was telling me is that See, these coins you could buy now, so light, like popcorn. It's easy. It's, it's um, very, you may have to go through some hoops because um, especially uh, Wiki Cat is not straightforward to buy. You need to have Trust Wallet 
and then you need to buy um, the BNB on the blockchain and um, and then swap it on pancake swap to wikicat so it's a slightly longer way but i was so determined today because i have uh, bought some shina inu and uh, vault inu on coinbase and uh, wikicat is new so i had to watch some videos and find out some information today and i finally bought it so basically what god was telling me about this dream is that they're light to buy right now so if even if you were to spend like 30 dollars each or 40 dollars each on each one of these you could grab hold of quite a bit of cryptos so i'm being obedient in uh just just sharing this dream and what happened yesterday with you guys so um, go and watch this brothers um, he's he's a prophet go and watch his channel seek the Lord and if the Lord leads you to it maybe you can go and make an investment into this one so I hope this will bless you thank you for watching and uh, one more thing there is there are scams of whatsapp numbers on all the comments that I've been watching literally i'm unable to control this so i never give out my whatsapp number um without knowing the person it's only people who reached out to me on email and in the uk and only when it's like you know when the lord leads you uh, otherwise i don't give out any whatsapp number any mobile number or my contact details on chats or never ask you to send me any messages or anything like that somebody's imitating my logo and then replying it through there so please don't think think it is me if i'm replying to your um comments then this is how it will look like my channel name and the logo comes across and the ones that are fake looks like this so please don't whatsapp anybody please don't i i've never asked anyone to even subscribe to my channel or like or comment or share this is something that i'm just doing because the lord tells me to do it i have no intention of growing my channel to whatever numbers and everything is for his glory for god's glory and it's all about king jesus and his kingdom and for every glory and every um appreciation everything needs to go to god not not me i'm i'm just i'm just another um servant in his kingdom so i just want to put it out there and i really thank you for your comments i really appreciate it and sometimes when i don't feel like doing it you know someone makes a comment saying that oh this this really touched my heart and you know something that really pushes you and i know it's god doing it so really appreciate your comments and thank you for the support it's gone over thousand subscribers which i never expected because sometimes it may take years to get this so um i'm really excited to what god is doing so i shall see you in the next video god bless you for now